morning guys what's up welcome back to another vlog i have not vlogged at all this past week and i am super excited to be vlogging again the week before last week i vlogged like every single day and i just desperately needed a little bit of a break and i'm really glad that i took that time but i'm also super excited to be vlogging again today planned out my whole day i made a second cup of coffee and i am just feeling super ready to take on this monday and i also want to thank cricket for sponsoring today's video i cannot believe that i'm getting the opportunity to work with a brand that I already know and have used for so long. I love Cricut. You guys know that I have an Explore Air 2 and I use it all the time for stuff for my business, Sun Bunny. I can't wait to show you guys how I use it today and talk about some of the awesome features. But before that, I wanna take a second to show you guys my newest addition. I got a new purse, which I'm sure you guys can already tell. And I actually got this in over the weekend. I haven't actually had a chance to wear it out yet, but I'm just like wearing it around the house because I'm so obsessed with it. It's a Louis Vuitton multi-poche bag and I got it in like the army green color. I purchased this from StockX. I don't even think they have them on the Louis Vuitton website right now. So I found mine gently used on StockX and I'll link it in the description if they have any more. It is the cutest thing ever and I am just like the happiest girl on the planet now. So one of the first things that I absolutely need to get done today is for my store. I have a huge drop coming this Friday at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So if you guys have not checked out my store, make sure that you do. Things sell out really quick and a lot of times I don't end up restocking because it's just not available anymore from the vendor that I got it from so be there because I think this is one of my most exciting drops yet I have some really awesome stuff coming and whenever I have a new drop coming to my store I like to make a bunch of accessory tags so these are the tags that I use for my accessories and I make these all by myself and I save so much money by using my Cricut and I also like to use the Cricut to create stickers which you guys know if you've ordered from me before sometimes I like to throw in a Sun Bunny sticker with your orders and I make them myself using my Cricut so we're gonna make a bunch of stickers and tags and I'm gonna show you guys how I do it all with my Cricut Explore Air 2. So I'm going to be using the Cricut brand printable sticker paper to make my Sun Bunny logo stickers. I love giving these out with my order. I just feel like it adds a nice little touch. So the first thing I'm going to do is load these into my printer and I'll show you guys how the Cricut Design Space works. So I go over to my computer and open up the Cricut Design Space. I love how simple the Cricut Design Space is to use for someone who's not super great at designing things. They make it really easy and they also have a ton of projects that are like ready to go that you can just customize yourself and use. So here Here's kind of what the design space looks like and a bunch of ideas for all this cool stuff you can make. Something I really want to try out is making face masks, specifically Sun Bunny face masks, because I feel like that would be so cool and fun to sell because you guys love the t-shirts that I made. But I'll show you guys my project. So this is kind of how I've designed the tags and stickers right here in the design space. So I just go over here to make it. And the first thing you do is print it on the sticker paper from your printer. Here's what they look like. I found that the Cricut brand of sticker paper definitely works so much better with my printer than just like the cheap kind. So I'm really glad I tried out their brand. So I just feel like it looks so much better. Then you have to select the material on the Cricut machine. So I'm gonna select paper and then load it in to the machine. The Cricut Explore Air 2 is one of their most versatile machines. It accurately cuts about a hundred different materials, including things like iron-on, vinyl, paper, and specialty materials like cardstock, fabric, poster board, adhesive foil, craft foam, canvas, faux leather, glitter paper, and so much more. You guys are able to see how helpful it is for me specifically for my business. Running a small business all on my own can be difficult, but with my Cricut machine, I'm able to save money by making my own stickers and logo tags. One of the other things I'm really looking forward to trying with my Cricut is making earring holders with colored cardstock paper so that I can put my gold hoops that I sell on my store directly onto earring and necklace holders that are customized with my logo. But if you don't own a business and you're still a creative person, the Cricut is perfect for home decor and creating gifts. I know around the holidays, I'm gonna especially be excited to use it for making gift tags and customize things for my family. And using the Cricut design space is super easy. It actually works on desktop and mobile. So if you're someone who's into doing DIY projects, you have to get the Cricut. Whenever you select a project, the Cricut design space actually walks you through step-by-step -step what you need to do. So it'll tell you when you need to print, how to load in the paper, what type of material to select. And if you go to the Cricut website, you'll see all of the accessories. They have so many different types of vinyl paper, iron-on, types of leather and fabric, and with a variety of materials it can cut, as well as the ability to draw and score using a scoring stylus, the Cricut Explore Air 2 has so many possibilities. So thank you again, Cricut, for sponsoring today's video, and if you guys want to check out the Cricut Explore Air 2, I will have a link in the description. You guys should totally get one. It's the coolest machine. You can do so much with it. I haven't even hardly grasped the surface of everything you can do with this machine. It's a 
little bit later and I'm on my way to my second hair appointment. So I told you guys that I wanted to go quite a bit lighter than what I am. I couldn't do it all at once because it would have completely fried my hair. So we're doing it in little increments and this appointment I'm still not expecting to get as light as I want it, but we'll see. We'll see how my hair pulls. I just want to make sure that I don't completely ruin my hair. So the next time you guys see me, my hair is going to be a little lighter. Several hours later, I'm obviously back home now and guys, it's a lot lighter. Sorry if you hear like a squeaking sounds. My dog's out there with their toy. Definitely a lot lighter. Still not quite as blonde as I want to be, but we have to do it in increments. I don't want to completely kill my hair. So I'm actually going to wait about six weeks, I think, this time before I go back and lighten it again. But I really do love how it turned out. So Chad is cooking us dinner. We're having a rotisserie chicken, mac and cheese, and I think Brussels sprouts. Yeah. And I'm sitting here on the couch watching The Office. I had to take my contacts out as they're driving my eyes crazy. I just put my glasses on. It's literally already seven. I feel like I was at the salon for a lot longer than I anticipated just because it took a while for my hair to lighten. So I didn't get as much done today as I had planned on getting done, but that's okay because whatever I didn't get done today, we will do it tomorrow. Hello. <laughs> Good morning guys, I just got back from my run and I decided to try this Unico Nutrition vegan meal replacement shake for my breakfast today. This was sent to me for free to test out, but it's not sponsored. Super, super thick and chocolatey. The taste is definitely a lot more like pronounced, I would say, than like a protein shake, but it's doable and it has a lot of really good clean ingredients in it. So I'm kind of excited to try this. I think I'm gonna start drinking one after my runs and I'll let you guys know like how I feel if I feel like it was filling and kept me full for a while. So I just made a bunch of things go on sale on my website. So if you guys have had your eye on something, I literally have never done this big of a markdown, but I really wanna clear out room because I have so much inventory to go through and I just need to make space. So these are all boxes full of inventory of stuff for my store that I just like have nowhere to put. So I haven't even taken it out of the boxes yet. Some of this stuff is going live Friday, like these taupe skirts and I have to get all of these unpackaged. I have to tag things. I have to update inventory in my system. But I like don't know what to do with all this stuff because my closet where I keep all of my inventory is like full right now. So go shopping if there's anything left by the time you guys see this vlog because you'll save a little bit of money and it'll help me get rid of some stuff. So I do have to run up to the post office. I'm like debating if I want to make another coffee now and just keep working for a little bit or if I just want to stop at Starbucks while I'm out and pick up a coffee. But I had so much Starbucks this past week that I feel like I should just like cool it, make a coffee here, keep working because I have so much to do. So it honestly like save me time. We will make the less desirable decision, but the smarter one. Here's my little post office run outfit. I'm literally wearing the most basic thing ever, but I swear this new bag just makes it look stylish. It's all in the bag. I'm just wearing this nasty gal cropped tank and these shorts that are from Pretty Little Thing and the oversized boyfriend jacket from my store. And then I throw this on and immediately it just looks like so stylish. That is my all-time favorite song right now, and I so wish that I could put it in the video so you guys could actually hear it. She's such a good artist, T.S. Gray. Go check her out. Listen to the full song. You guys will love it. Another one of her songs that I absolutely love is called Honestly. So if you guys haven't heard of her, go check her out. On a side note, I wanted to show you guys these sunglasses. They are coming to the store this Friday. These are the Carmen 2.0 sunglasses. So they're very similar to the original Carmen sunglasses that I've had on my store since I opened, but these ones are a little bit of a bigger frame, which I 
like and the sides dip down here and then come back up so they have a little bit of shape on the arm and I really like them of course I love the first ones but I think I like that these are just like a little bit bigger and a little bit wider so they're just like more edgy I feel like anyways I am going to run these packages in and then go right back home I am not going to Starbucks I decided to be smart we are going to save some money although i have no idea what i'm doing for lunch I'm back home and i decided i'm going to order chipotle for lunch because i haven't had it in forever and i love chipotle i usually get a bowl with sofritas rice black beans cheese lettuce corn salsa and tomato salsa and i'm so annoyed because they have free delivery right now if you order over 15 and if chad was here obviously our order would be over 15 but because it's just for me i have to pay four dollars but whatever it's worth it because i am starving and there's literally nothing because we haven't gone grocery shopping yet this week I just got everything hung up that I need for this next drop. I still have a ton more stuff to go through, but at least I'm caught up for this drop. So now I'm gonna go ahead and start individually weighing the items so I can put in the weights for shipping purposes. And I have to clean up all of this trash that's everywhere. It is lunchtime. This right here key to my freaking heart but it's like so much i can never eat all of it just finished eating lunch it was so good i let the dogs out and now i'm about to get back to work i actually have to shoot some content photos for somebody just of the accessories that are dropping on friday so that's pretty much going to be the rest of my day is just working on all of that and then starting my laundry so i think i'm going to end this vlog here thank you guys so much for watching if you're not already subscribed be sure to click that subscribe button and i'll see you in my next video